Hello guys. Welcome back to my Glenwood series. Now this one isn't is like two days later after I recorded the other one on eleven eleven sixteen. I know these don't go up exactly on that day, but yeah. Anyhow I've been working on that kind of shopping mall thing in the dance club that I mentioned in the last one. And they've come together pretty well. I haven't worked on anything on else behind me or the road or anything. I've been working on these. Now, to show you them, this is it. My finished product. As you see here, it kind of looks similar, but not. Um, I don't have a name for all of them. Like, I'll tell you this. Most of them are having names, but I'm not sure yet. So here, though it may not have a sign on it, you're probably wondering, what the heck is this? This is a Bass Pro Shop. Yeah, I just kind of built shelves. I didn't want to put a checking out counter there because I was like, eh, it just wouldn't work. So we have shelves. They have the really tall shelves there, which you have to jump to grab things. And this would be like their old kind of store. Um... This is, like, where they make the stuff, but I just kind of left it like this because I didn't really know what to put there. Yeah. So, give you a show of the room quickly. That's what all... If you're wondering what the water's dripping, then... Yeah, you'll figure out that later. So, on up the stairs, we have more shelving. We have our clothes, and... Oh my goodness, what is this? Well, you here you have your armor on display. This. But they have they normally have fish tanks there and I did put squid in this, but I guess they died. Oh well. Everything has a lifespan. Yeah. So here's an overview of this room. I'll come back to here. Yeah, and I also have skylights up there, which I'll go take a look at now. Um, I also did not put the speaker down. Darn it! Um yeah. Skylights. They're even. Wait a minute. Oh no, I made this one. I made that one bigger. Which is going to annoy me now. But I will I should never come up here. Yeah. Next we have this shop. If you can guess it. If you guess Best Buy, you're correct. Um, yeah, same thing, you didn't put a checkout counter in, I just put, like, a crap ton of shelves, and then I, up here, we have some more shelves, we have our bin, but here, sometimes they have, like, games, like, systems set up, you actually go test them out, so that's what I did here, you know, like, your test out thing, this must be a pad there, yeah, no windows here, though, um, I did make the Best Buy logo, which I think is really nice looking, now this, this is like that fancy steak restaurant, I could not remember the name, and I was going to pull it up on Google Maps so I could take a look at it, because it's downtown, by T.T. Wentworth Museum, and I'm thinking, what's the name? I don't remember the name. So I tried to make it, this would be like where you check in and they take you to your table, which is here, and I left, these are left open on purpose, and they have this outside place. Now, do what you're not supposed to do. You gotta be very careful here. This garden actually belongs to that restaurant. The reason, it, because they grow their own, they grow their own wheat to make them bread, own watermelon, own pumpkins, carrots, and potatoes. I was going to grow beetroots, but I could not figure out how to do that. Uh huh. And actually, that water they have there, um, I decided to make it, it actually flows out into the, into there, so it's not still, it's constantly moving. Um, where's the rest of the water coming from that feeds it? Who knows? Oh well. Now, this is gonna be kind of a short one. Oh wait, I almost forgot. Pretzel Maker! I have the realistic prices, plus I cannot fit combo on there, so I end up having to put the O's on the other side. It took me a while to figure out... Okay, how many spaces do I need between O and three ninety nine? Those are actually the correct prices for any pretzel makers original combo, pretzel dog combo, and pretzel bite combo. 
which should be 1, 2, 3, and 4. No, trace that. The pretzel dog bite is 1, the pretzel dog is 2, and the original is 3. I believe that's what it said on the sign. Okay. So, a little bit of seating there, some benches. Okay. Ah, there's something on my mouse. Now, here. Oh, sorry, I gotta pause it for a moment. I gotta quickly do something. Hold on. Sorry for that weird bit right there. At first, I thought I was like, okay, I'm done with this. I've already done what I was supposed to do. And then I was like, wait, someone's calling me, so I had to go do that. So, okay, we have Glow Tech Dance Club. Now we're walking down. We have wonderful little lights right here. Guide your way. And you come to this set of doors. Hey, let me in. Well, this right here is where, like, bouncers would stand. Now, for to get into Glow Tech Dance Club, though it is a non-alcoholic, um, dance club, it's a club and all. Yeah, yeah. Though it's not alcoholic and sexual like stuff, um, there are rules. You at least have to have a pair of shorts or pants. Um, shoes, no need. Shirts, you don't need them unless you're female. Then we wish you to cover your areas. Um, yes. Now, you must be a high school level of 14 years old, 14 ninth grader, or older to get into the club. Now, once you're getting in, um, they'll give you, you get, it's not as dark as I want it to be. I decided to brighten it up just so you could see, but it's rather dim. Now, glow tech, you, you, when you dance, you get glow sticks. And they'll like, you can, you get like an, a normal amount of glow stick. But the shop down where they have, they sell little, little bits of food and drink. You can buy more glow sticks. Now, as you go in, whoop -hoo! Yeah, it's actually really bright. Um, I meant to take some of this out, which I'm going to do right now. Okay, so, now, you can't really see it now, but it says glow right over there. Oh yeah, that looks much better. Yeah, this is what it's supposed to be like. Now, this right here is where the DJs and the VIP can go. Dance and sit and all. Um, show you this right here. There. Now, this is like the only lit up area. And it doesn't even need to be that bright. Ew. Okay, it needs to be a little brighter. And I'm just gonna be... I'm just gonna stick a torch back here. Um, yeah. So, now you get to see me edit things. And as, um... Oh, I should have done... This instead of this. Like... That! Oh my goodness. Loads a ton of difference. They can still have their glowstone thing up there, but, woo! Mm -hmm. Now, so you can see them, I'm going to start putting, um, highlighting the, uh, that. Okay, here. Sorry. Okay. Um, there. This is the dance floor. You have colored stuff. You have colored glass. The VIPs are up there. Here's your shop. Um, I'll show you the inside of the shop. This is what you look like from the inside of the shop. Only one or maybe two people will be working out at, and here at a time. Yeah, it's uh, just a cool little dance club. 14 or older to get in. So, thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it, please like, subscribe. Comment down below on something you'd like me to do, or RAIN! Or something you would like me to possibly add. See that lightning there. Um, I still need three more shops over here. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you all later. Goodbye.